Hey everybody, Bob here from RFinder, W2CYK. Today we're going to uh, demo the new version of RFinder, version 4.14.173, specifically some of the new configuration settings. We've had some questions about it and wanted to uh, give you guys a little tutorial on how to do it. So uh, first in the front screen you press menu and then choose application settings and you'll see that um, this is pretty much the same as some of the older settings that we uh, added about a month ago um, but we've added now a remote SSID and what that's for is um, uh, when you post to APRS the local SSID will post your local um, your local check-in uh, and the remote SSID will let everybody around the machine know that you're on that machine so, um, extending the social functions to, uh, uh, to the location of the machine itself. So, that's pretty cool. So, uh, make sure you put your name in so they know your name uh, during the posting also. And turn on APRS up here at the top uh, if you want to. So, we're going to jump out of here. And I'm going to jump to this new function, which is Worldwide Echolink Live Nodes. Now, this is the only way of doing this in the world is uh, with one click to be able to actually find live nodes and connect right to them. And anybody that's attempted to, uh, to find a live node in the world knows that um, uh, many of them are either down or logged off, not connected. So it's tough to find a live machine many times. It could take you uh, quite a few tries. Uh, not anymore. Now it's just uh, a single click out of... Uh, uh, R finder and you'll see that uh, we have the repeater detail up here for AA3RG um, and it's showing the town now one of the other um, uh, Achilles heels in uh, echo link is that you don't always have the QTH of the machine uh, the information is very inconsistent so uh, um, uh, so sometimes people don't put the information in consistently so uh, we fixed that we have uh, figured out a way of uh, of uh, getting that information into the data. You'll notice that this echo link number is underlined so it's hot. If I click on it, I'll connect right to it. So I've connected right to it. I can go on and connect and do a, uh, a QSO right now, uh, but uh, that's not the scope of this demo. So you can see that I'm checked in, W2CYK, and you'll notice um, on, um, on uh, APRS that I am in fact checked in at my local QTH on the North Shore of Long Island uh, into AA3RG as well as another uh, uh, repeater that I checked into a little while ago, 9 Hotel 1 uh, BBS and you'll see that I am in fact checked into it and it shows all the information about uh, you know that I'm checked in through uh, Echolink and stuff like that but on APRFSI I am tracking myself and I can click on my other SSID, the 14, the remote, and you can see that on that map near that machine, I'm showing that I am checked into that. So people near the machine now know that you are connected with uh, Echo Link. So that's the demo. So thank you very much. Uh, thank you for your support. Please don't forget to like us on Facebook and to uh, leave us a, uh, a nice review in the App Store and Google Play if you think we've earned it. Uh, we work uh, we work hard for you guys uh, to provide you with the uh, most complete repeater directory on the planet. 170 countries, uh, 50,000 plus machines, and we just keep adding more and more features uh, constantly. So keep your ideas coming. Thank you very much, and everybody have a great field day.